Hi everyone, welcome to We On Live broadcast from New York City. I'm your host, Susan Tehrani. First, let's get you up to speed with this hour's headlines before we go straight into our first story. United States not involved in the assassination of Hamas leader Ismail Haniyeh, says Secretary of State Anthony Blinken, reiterates the importance of a ceasefire in Gaza as being quote-unquote imperative. The red flag of revenge raised over the Jamkaran Mosque in Iran's holy city of Om. This after the assassination of Hamas leader Ismail Haniya, Iran's Supreme Leader Khamenei says avenging Haniya's death is in Tehran's duty. Russian military begins third round of drills to train troops in tactical nuclear weapons. The drills are part of the Kremlin's messaging to the West to limit support for Ukraine. A narrow escape for Sudan Army Chief General Abdel Fateh al bohran as a drone strike hits the Gibbet military base in eastern Sudan, where he is a present. Five others killed in that same attack. <laughs> Myanmar's military government extends a state of emergency for another six months as the junta struggles to maintain its grip on power with fighting flaring on multiple fronts and the economy in crisis. <laughs> the men's and women's triathlon events at the Paris Olympics finally went ahead after pollution concerns on the River Seine. For all the latest news, download the WeOn app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.